Louisiana's mask mandate will stay in effect, but Governor Edwards did announce some big changes that will be coming starting tomorrow. So the mask mandate still in effect and you are still asked to socially distance. Edwards lifted the capacity limits in most places like bars, restaurants, salons and even gyms. Event venues and sporting events are allowed to be at 50% capacity now. But the biggest thing is that the new proclamation also does away with the 11 p.m. curfew on places serving alcohol. Those hours, however, are controlled at the parish level now instead of the state. And with that announcement, there's now a lot of focus on New Orleans and how they will deal with easing restrictions if they will at all. The city has always taken a slower approach than the rest of the state. And as Mike McDaniel explains, some of the hardest hit businesses are paying attention. At the Golden Lantern in the French Quarter, news of most state restrictions being lifted were just as refreshing as the drinks being served by Greg Abair. It's been rough on us since the pandemic. Before the pandemic, the bar on Royal Street served up drinks 24 hours a day. Under current restrictions, alcohol can't be served past 11 p.m. It's hard closing a bar, having to call last call when we've never had to call last call. The state is now lifting that 11 p.m. restriction and capacity limits for bars and restaurants effective Wednesday. Parishes now have the authority to set the rules. In Orleans Parish, the city of New Orleans has been more conservative with reopening. A city spokesman tells Eyewitness News until the city makes an announcement, those current restrictions will stay in place. We will thoroughly assess uh, what the governor announced and I'll make decisions accordingly. A bear commends the mayor's approach on reopening and doesn't expect to go back to serving drinks around the clock. He just wants a few more hours of business. But what we're hoping is that they'll keep us open till 2, at least 2 a.m. Mayor Latoya Cantrell says data will determine next steps. With a percent positivity rate now below 1% in Orleans Parish and vaccinations increasing, Hebert hopes those numbers will be good for business. Whatever the mayor announces, he says he'll follow the regulations. If it wasn't for her and her strictness, keeping us a little regulated, that helped us get to where we are now. In the meantime, last call will still happen until the doors never have to be locked again. Mike McDaniel, Eyewitness News.